Hi everyone, I am Marco Antonio Regil and I greet you in this special and exclusive conference for Hotmark Masters. This first level digital online event which Hotmart offers all of you and me. It is a great pleasure to be part of the Hotmart family and to be able to share with you what the change from traditional media to digital media has meant to me and how to have worked this year with Hotmart has brought a, a big, big change in my life this year and literally helped me turn a dream that I wanted to make come true in just that reality. But after that in my life, which is when I, I met Robert Kiyosaki, the author of this world bestseller book, one of the best sellers in the history of books called Rich Father, Poor Father. I'm not sure if you have read it, but I do recommend it. I met Robert Kiyosaki. I met Blair Singer, the author of Salesman of Sales Dogs. I also recommend that. And I went to live in Arizona, in the United States. First, I lived in Mexico. Then I went to Miami. I left Miami to go to Arizona. And no one understood where I was go why I was going there. But I went there because I wanted to go professionally. There came a moment when I got tired uh, of doing TV shows. And not because of the TV shows that I love. But at some point, they started asking me to do other things that I did not like. And as an employee, well, I had to do it. But I... I don't mean to take too. I don't mean to take too long here, but as I do not want to deviate much. But I understood at some point in my career when I had to do things that I didn't like, that I wanted to enhance. I wanted to be an entrepreneur. Then I started studying Robert Kiyosaki's materials. I ended up in Arizona taking a three-day workshop that fascinated me, and I said I wanted to be an entrepreneur. I want to think as an entrepreneur. I went to Arizona. I made. I started friendship with Kiyosaki. I started giving him workshops in Spanish and I started addressing those issues in Latin America because I started to learn in all the important topics and Robert told me it has to do it has a lot to do with this Hotmart Masters issue when I met Robert Kiyosaki in person not only going to his workshops uh, we became friends, we met and he was told uh, about what, what, what I was doing and I told him why I was there I also told him that I had to stop depending on my work in television and I, I told him that I I wanted to do television um, but only the programs I wanted and that there was the one specific program that just triggered me I've always said that sometimes things end up as the most beautiful and greatest directions in life and precisely that program that they made that they made me do and that I did not want to do and that I had to do because I, I was under a salary contract and I had no choice um, it had television concepts that I did not agree with it was this person this producer was very bitter he wanted to force the tears and it is very different when something comes out organically uh, and when you are looking for it and uh well, it was a total delusion. I was very disappointed because I said, I, I want to do it, but I want the work that I want to do. I wanted to choose a program, so I needed to have financial freedom. That's how Kiyosaki's book came into my hands. I read it, so I went to Arizona, um, and when I became friends with him, he told me, perfect, let's do one thing. I'll teach you to think like an entrepreneur. I'll teach you there in your mind for, to become an entrepreneur which is a topic that I'm passionate about and uh, I'm sh this, which is why I congratulate you here on your Hotmart Master because surely if you're here it's because you have some concerns and you say hey my business could be digital I could be an expert in digital marketing I could share the things that I know to get ahead and create my on online business my online school, my online courses so I congratulate you for being here 
If Robert I had, I had just that concern. Robert Kiyosaki helped me in exchange. I told him, I'll help you to know the market in Spanish. But something that he told me was very important and marked me. I want to share it here with you because that was the key. I say, I have to, I have to learn if I really want to stop working for money and learn how to have money working for me. What do I have to do? And Robert showed it to me and it stuck with me for a lifetime. And I keep repeating it on and on being an essential part of what I share and continue to teach through my online courses in Hotmart. The topic there the topic that there is a school and the traditional school they teach us to read these are important they teach us to write obviously super important they teach us to add and subtract basic math it is obviously super important but it is not enough what they teach us in a school what they teach you in a school is not enough because they don't teach us the necessary tools that are required in order to be financially free in order to create our own business so we can be at least an independent service provider and that education I could give you a huge list of the subjects that we could learn but they don't teach you to sell for example much less of the digital technology market even if you're doing a career in the university that is already well advanced where they talk about the digital technology market but the truth is that they don't teach you to sell They don't teach you the psychology of knowing your clients, of solving a problem, of about leadership. They don't teach you how to create teams, how to solve problems, how to find opportunities where there are problems. They don't teach you any of that. In other words, they don't teach you basically financial education. There are other very important educations, but they don't give you financial education. And by financial, I don't just mean... I mean, it has nothing to do with being a public accountant or understanding how to add or subcontract. No, I mean, how money works. That's what I'm talking about. How the money flows. What, an, what a business person is. What an entrepreneur is. What is a venture? What do you need? What is the lifestyle of an entrepreneur versus that of an employee? They don't teach you financial education. And that's what Kiyosaki told me. And the problem you have in Mexico and in Latin America is that the countries like Mexico and those in Latin America, they are rich countries, but with no financial education. That is, as for the money, they have a poor education. Rich countries with poor education. And what do I mean by that? Rich countries, because Mexico hasn't produced silver, produces oil, it has beaches, music, it has culture, just like Colombia, Brazil, Argentina, and Ecuador. We are countries with a cultural di diversity, with food, gastronomy, with many riches and history. We are places that... That is why all tourists come and enjoy the things that are here. But we don't have a financial education rich in resources, but by, nothing, but by not having financial education, we fall into corruption. Then he said financial education is lacking and the other education that is missing, not only the financial one, is emotional education. We are countries and sometimes foreign people will tell us that, but it's true and I didn't realize that we are highly emotional countries. We love pampering, we like to hug, connecting, we give our friendship, we are passionate, creative, we have wonderful things, but at the same time we are very, very dramatic, we are very emotional. Why? For generations and generations we have grown up listening to dramatic music, we have grown up watching television series or soap operas or stories and now they are no longer on TV, now they are on Netflix. On, or other dramatic platforms you see them for example in this, you see the Spanish series La Casa de Papel it is a drama and psychological problems and I'm not criticizing it I love it but they are sick people are really psychologically ill not a single one of them has gone to therapy and if you have watched The Rose of Guadalupe and you grew up here in these Venezuela and our Mexican novels it's the same thing that is that The roller coaster of ups and downs of emotions added to the dual financial education gives us a formula that keeps us in poverty. 
And when I understood that, I said, wow, how strong it is. But that's the bad news. The good news is that with all the beautiful and powerful things we have, if we learn to transmit them through training each other as they do not give they, they do not give us this education in school if we can educate each other we can bring out the best in each other because we're rich countries without a financial and emotional education that's a bad news but what what are the good news we can change it because everything is here between the left ear and the right ear we can reprogram our minds and when I got what I had to do to move on to get ahead and not depend on television keep doing it when I want it because I want it but not as an obligation it is being able to say no I won't do the program or no I won't work with that producer I don't want that campaign it does not match my heart I won't do it I said I have to become financially independent so I struggled to learn from Robert and of businessmen that he got to, to that he introduced it to me to surround myself with entrepreneurs. What frustrated me the most was going to a city for moms to sell tickets, offer promotions, read in television interviews. And I would go and fill them in a room so I could just give them two or three hours of my knowledge so people would go like when would the next workshop be when we will have a deeper one and then they would have to wait about three months and i would have to sell the tickets and etc so during those 18 years in addition to my television career lecturing was very beautiful on the one hand but on the other hand highly frustrating and tiring having to face trips take an airplane reach a city the I would have the press release and finally get to the theater where, where I would say one or two hours or three hours then back again to the city and I'd arrive and keep ministering my lectures at the same week it is exhausting but the actual time in front of the people is just two or three hours at most sometimes about 90 minutes sometimes one hour I'll tell them hey you brought me here and you're paying me the same price regardless of receiving a one hour or three hours Hours. Well, that's how you go because you follow an event with many exhibitors. I couldn't give them more and I wanted to give them more. But the problem with digital is that even if you're ready, if, even if you already have the Facebook and, and Instagram profiles, if you follow a podcast, I still have it, and we are ready with more than seven million downloads. But how to monetize that podcast? I didn't have the faintest, faintest idea of how digital market, the digital market worked. I had heard of people selling ebooks, but I didn't. No, I mean, despite, I didn't know how it was how it was done. But in 2018, I left Telemundo. In, in 2018, I resigned and I told them, "Look, I'll keep doing TV when you call me, when you give me special things, but I have to focus on the digital. It is a financial plan." Uh, I'll quit a super high paying job and somehow I have to create my digital course. I have to capitalize and monetize all things online. I have to make a living from this and give people what I want so badly to give them. And many people uh, stop dreaming because they are thinking about how they're going to do it and I would I would wonder what is it that I wanted to do many people will go the other way around they would they're gonna ask how to do it how to do it but you are going to go in a place and you have to be very clear in your heart about what you want to do I continue on entertainment on the entertainment television in my spare time my free times for, for seasons, uh, to the people of Mexico, to the Latin market, but I wanted to communicate much more deeply and 
con and convey the, the knowledge that I had acquired, what I had learned, to make my dreams come true with a very special emphasis in financial and emotional education, which is where I experienced my most amazing transformations. You cannot take someone else where you have not been. How am I going to teach something I haven't done? The only thing I can show you is what I have done. I mean, I, I mean this is what I want to do. So suddenly I'm checking my Instagram and managing my social networks and I have help uh, to create the, you know, to, to do the creative things and uh, etc. But I answer all comments in my social networks and I get some private messages and it's too many. It's impossible to see them all. And suddenly by chance, one of the messages show up with this pretty girl saying, Marco, my name is Monsaha. I work in a company called Hotmart. I've never heard of Hotmart. And we are. I, I would love to talk with you because I know that you have been teaching classes for many years and I would like to know if you would not be interested in taking a digital course. And I was like, whoa. It was like a soap opera. The sky opened and I said, was it possible? It looks like she's reading my mind. I'm looking for someone to help me. Who's hot Mark? I already got in and answered her with a little distrust because you got lots of proposals and on the internet you have criminals, they want to get your money and they have to, you have to be very careful on the internet. So I replied with distress and I, and hello, Mosra, I'm interested, I said, and I was playing, I, I was holding myself, I was desperately be, because I needed to achieve this. And I told her that I, don't, I didn't know Hotmart. And then she sent me information. She gave me her phone. We made an appointment. I already saw that Hotmart was like a big company. She sent me samples of courses they had and said, wow, there are things, really quality things here. Because all there, there, there are so many shallow platforms. And I said, I, I could see that Hotmart, they were quality uh, content and they had credibility. I started seeing everything and I had a meeting in Mexico. They introduced me to Maria Monte Mayor, who was last year at this event. And she has many courses. One of the most recommended is a beautiful course. It's called The Art of Love in Your Body. And then I, I got to know Maria. She gave me access to her course. And it's wonderful because Maria talks to you about losing weight, not through a diet, but by loving your body and accepting every part of you. In other words, psychological issues that were 100% compatible with what I teach and with what I know. And Maria is a first-class woman, a very skilled professional with ethics. I invited her to the podcast and she said, we're going to recommend the course. We, had, we went out to sell it and we had this webinar, a master class. We had a huge amount of people entering. Thousands of people came. Many bought the course. We had this digital revenue coming up. Happy people. Hey, I love Maria's course. It's the best. And I saw it clearly. And I said, wow, wonderful. According to what people asked, they, they wanted an emphasis on financial matters. They were interested in the emotional, and we made adjustments. So we prepared a course, and uh, we started recording, and we, we would launch it at March 12th, because Hotmart told me, Marco, you have to establish a date. And when we launched the course, the course was not finished. We had the first models. We were finishing producing the, the next models and we said, it's perfect, let's go. We're doing it like this. Let's see what people say. And, and then we, we were, were going to create the, the remaining models on March. Well, we did all of that and prepared the advertisement company and contacted an expert in, a, in digital ads. And I, I, I'm really, I really appreciate what he did. I have much affection for that. And 
you got all these precious people at Hotmark. And on March 12, without having the slightest idea that the coronavirus would arrive because it was a project that had started a few years ago, we launched the course. We did three master classes, one for people who were super VIP and had answered the survey. We, we gave them a super special prize that would never give again. We did another master class with a company that is also affiliated with Hotmart, which is called Prendica, with whom uh, we had worked in Mexico before doing physical events. I made another master class open for all who wanted and follow my social networks and suddenly the course the registration begins it was successful we finished it we added another class to it we reinforce it we correct it increase it I started hiring people when everyone started running in the physical world and I started hiring people there were two of us on my team nothing more we were two people and very soon we, be we became three and suddenly it got huge at the same time the course was growing it was a task course and uh, we, we saw it lengthening at the same time it was happening and the normal sadness of the world entered with the coronavirus we, we had to cancel events physical events and they started to cancel all the events the clients would cancel all of them of April, May, June and then we had to cancel all the events all the events we had face to face were cancelled and even the advertisement campaign for television was cancelled because we could not record it so suddenly what happened to us is what happened to a lot of people we had no work all events were cancelled we lost all our tickets if it was not for our digital course, I don't know how we would have passed by 2020 because at the same time these events fell. It was horrible and painful. Our course began to be more successful and more and more. And so we, we weren't going to pull it out. And uh, we began to correct it and improve it more and more. And the initial offer stayed. And so far the offer we have was the temporary offer then we spread it to help more people and we helped more people enter the course because the offer was working so we we started to do things on uh, on a live platform and we lived a transformation my, my dream was being able to give people valuable content but not in a limited way two hours or less than that so in the course I have 10 classes learning activities they will no these are aimed at the mind money the heart so we added another course and we had a super package there are many hours of content there in a physical world I would have spent like one week giving daily classes and in the digital platform I can teach them and they can see the classes wherever they want at whatever time they want for a very very affordable price you got no flight tickets involved you got no hotels you don't have to rent a room you don't have to sell tickets and pay 20,000 in commissions or anything like that um, I can read the testimonials the, the success stories I have read and, and all of that made my dream come true And Hotmart showed up my way, and it was definitely great. I appreciate it. It was a hallmark in my career. We are very happy producing the same 
uh, income that I had on television but without working for television working for me today I don't have to ask for permission I am my boss I have a team I work with uh, as a collaborator and I and they take responsibilities they are delegated and we're all managers we're working together and I have had the enormous blessing of finding a precious team with which we're growing and we read the testimonial the testimonial text of you know, the people and I love it it's beautiful I love the digital I love digital marketing I love being able to be here doing this conference for you you see the kitchen there you got my room I've been here and from here I can communicate with millions and millions and the dreams came true I can touch more people I can give all of them more information for a very low price compared to the physical world and they themselves tell us that this is what they want the most and I'm going to continue I keep preparing myself uh proving my knowledge and I have the great pleasure of sharing what is in my heart and what makes me happy. I had nothing but gratitude because this year has been very hard for so many people, including for us. I have not seen my family for months. Also because of you who have, have the curiosity of creating this online business to, and, and also because you want to promote the courses, you want to bring content closer to people, you want to connect knowledge to students at incredibly affordable prices with platforms that sometimes you can access as you wish at your convenience that will not disappear like you know in, in an in-person conference that begins and very soon finishes if not if not I mean you can access information whenever you want and I congratulate you because this path will help you a lot in this, to achieve your independence and today digital market the digital is everything anyone not connected to the digital to the digital world that is not connected with this digital market is lagging behind so with the coronavirus all things were sped up uh, I remember Netflix Netflix started years ago it came close and all those who are not there when it, when it didn't exist I mean, very young people, they, they were not there. I mean, what are you talking about? They, they are probably asking. But we were there. We, we, we got to know Blockbuster. Um, you know, that, that famous video renting company. Well, Netflix emerged a long time ago. Uh, and the idea is that they, 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 they would offer videos. You would not need to rent videos. And those companies left at Netflix. They rejected Netflix. And they did not have the vision to hug Netflix because Netflix was looking for a partner and wanted to partner with Blockbuster with some strong international brands. And they said no to Netflix. The question is, where is Blockbuster? I did an advertisement com campaign for Blockbuster, for, for Blockbuster years ago when they exist. So now you have Netflix thriving and it was rejected. And now you got Google Play, Apple TV, and Zoom, StreamYard, and these are all platforms. And Hotmart is, ob is obviously part of this digital world. And I will tell you one thing it has been a wonderful moment. And I congratulate you for being here. I wish you with all of my heart that that between two options you do not stick with Blockbuster and, and that you do not stick with the physical past. You can continue with one foot there, one hand in the physical world, but you have to be in the digital world. Don't be like Blockbuster. Don't be like the television stations that didn't pay attention and that are suffering now. Be like Netflix and say, I'm going to embrace the digital world. Nothing that is worth in life is easy, but you are going to love it.